Alright, it's time to play something very joyful. <laughs> so, uh, I don't know if you've seen me play before, you've probably heard me tell this story, but um, it's true, so it's not like I'm going to change the story. I, mean, <laughs> I grew up in Ohio. Woo! Yeah! All right. <laughs> so, uh, like proper Midwest, you know? It's like uh, good old nice people. Like, we're just a bunch of like, you know, Canadians. So, you can trust people there, you know. We may be passive aggressive, but you know, at least we're nice and honest. <laughs> and then after living here for ten years, it was strange. I remember the first day I moved here, I was walking down the street and I was like saying hello to people on the street. <laughs> people were like, You're an axe murderer? <laughs> Then I moved to Los Angeles. Um, yeah, I mean, sometimes I get a little down in LA. I never really got down in New York, I, mean, I should say I never did, but it was one of those things where I, uh, I don't know, you could just walk outside, I know everyone talks about the energy here, but it's true, man. and there's something about Los Angeles where anyone, anytime anyone ever asks me, like, should I move to LA? I'm like, well, do you have, like, five of your best friends living there? Because otherwise, don't do it. <laughs> You'll get so bored and lonely, and uh, you have to drive everywhere, you have to make plans with people, you can just bump into people. I like bumping into people. I hate making plans. So, anyway, I, I was going through some things in LA, and I just, uh, I decided I, need, I needed to write something that every time I started playing it, it would make me smile. Like I would, um, people use this word in LA all the time to, to manifest things. And, and sometimes it gets really annoying when there's like trigger words in Los Angeles. But, but there's truth to it, you know, there, there is truth to it. You know, saying like, I'm gonna make my own beauty, I'm gonna make my own joy and happiness. And I used to move around a lot thinking it was the geography that was keeping me down. And oh, if I move there, that's gonna be great and I'll be happy. And, and I realized I had this epiphany on top of a mountain um, behind my house out in Los Angeles. I went up for a hike with a little backpacker guitar and uh, sat down there like Buddha style with my cross leg. And I looked over the city and I thought, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to write something that's just like, every time I play it, it's going to make me smile. So I'm not a morning person. Every time I wake up now, I drink like four cups of coffee and then I play this song. <laughs> and so I start my day every day. So I figured I'd play it for you. And if there's anyone here, you know, that's going through something, they're down a bit. Uh, you're welcome to use this. You can play it in the morning. It's not that complicated. Go polish the dust off my soul. Go listen to some rock and roll. Don't care. Let's 
Let's not forget we were alive. We were alive. Take me. Yes. Yeah.